Okay, today we're going to change some partitions in Windows 10 to allow you to do a boot on Linux. From your desktop, right click, click Disk Management. Okay, so we've got two partitions already installed. That's a system reserved one, and this is the, the Windows partition. So first thing we need to do is shrink the Windows partition to allow some space. We can see that it's roughly 76 gigabytes uh, partition and there's roughly 65 gigabytes of free space. If we shrink this partition down by 50,000 megabytes, that's roughly 50 gigabytes. And we can see this is the unallocated space. We can put a new partition in there. It doesn't have to be the full size. So if we put 10,000 megabytes, give us a partition roughly 10 gigabytes. We can see that we have three partitions and an unallocated space. So we could put another partition in the unallocated. We can uh, delete, shrink, or extend this partition. Okay, so we're going to extend this one. And we can add a name for partitions. As needed. So if we apply a partition volume name, data, and windows, so you can see exactly what's going on. To make it look a little bit more like my hard disk, we can uh, shrink the Windows partition down again. So we can see that there's 15 gigabytes free, so you want to leave at least 10 gigabytes more than you're going to need. And then we've got the Windows partition, we've got the unallocated space to install Linux, and we've got our data partition. Uh, we can add a simple volume into the unallocated space, and then can't extend the data partition into, into this unallocated space, we can only extend to the right. So we can extend the Windows partition back out. And that's how to alter your partitions to allow you to do all good.